These are incredibly unfamiliar times that we're in right now. Everywhere you go, there's news about people being infected and dying. Everywhere's being locked down. McDonald's has had to close. I don't know what I'm going to do with my life with no Big Macs. Everywhere we go, the news is talking about all the negatives. When I'm at work, everyone's talking about all the negatives. And you know what? Today, I've decided that I've had enough. We're going to be looking at the positives from this outbreak. Now, you might be thinking, positives for a pandemic? Are you a psychopath? I am slightly, but that's not the point I'm trying to make. I've been looking online and I found some interesting things. So I figured that we could go and just have a look at them. So we're on r slash coronavirus memes. I knew it had to exist. Stay safe, by the way. Doctors practicing coronavirus treatment in North Korea. <laughs> that's a really good, it's not even edited. <laughs> no one can get infected if they're all dead. <laughs> Oh, I can see why that's top posted. This is people's careers now. They just get to read their own Reddit. Joker. I've not actually seen Joker yet. You are not a clown. You are the entire circus. Senator Paul casts lone vote against coronavirus funding bill. Rand Paul becomes the first senator to pass positive for the coronavirus. <laughs> you get what you fucking deserve. <laughs> People say karma doesn't exist. Karma is, is right there. It's That's mental. <laughs> That's what you get, Senator Paul. I'm not saying anyone deserves coronavirus, obviously not. But that's a perfect example of how karma works. Batman meme. YOLO, I'm young and health. <laughs> You'll kill Alfred, you prick. It's not about you. Yes, there's so many people, like myself, we're young, fit. If we get the virus, chances are we'll be alright. It's not like some people think. It's not going to be like a flu. I'm not a medical professional. I'm not giving any advice. But... If we get it, we're going to know about it, but we should be fine, and it's not about us being fine. I was at work, literally thousands of customers came in, in the day. Thousands. One young person could have had it and thought, oh, but they'll be fine. How many old people were there? They get in fence paint and gardening tools, so they can self-isolate, and then you're going to get them sick. You know, poor Alfred. Big up Alfred. Oh, I miss Alfred. Alfred's not in Arkham Asylum. When I hear celebrities having breakdowns in their million dollar homes. The world's smallest violin. I can see this Spongebob meme. That's, that's a, it's a bit dead, sorry. It's a bit dead. I'm not one of those guys that shits on people just because they're rich and famous. You know, we all have emotions. We all have the same potential to be where they are. You know, if we are rich and famous, would we want to be crapped on just because we were successful? No. It's... Oh, I never joke a meme. Um, this virus started spreading and then... Dad, why most of my friends have birthdays in December? <laughs> yeah. We're gonna have another baby boomer. Baby boom. You know, we got boomers now. The boomers are going into self-isolation and we're making more boomers. The boomer cycle repeats! I just need, like, three months off work paid. Universe, this is not exactly what I meant. <laughs> Are you getting paid? I big up. Dear potential looters, I wouldn't. Sincerely, the armed dads stuck in their homes for three weeks being forced to watch their kids make TikTok dance videos. I forgot like that. Parents stuck at home while their kids do TikTok. Hopefully Senator Paul is stuck at home with his kids doing TikToks. Day five of quarantine. Day five? I mean, if that's what you want to do with your time. <laughs> Tell you what, more power to you. You're not going out and infecting other people. That's good. Good on you. Big up. Repost man. Right, let's have a look at this. I've, I was looking for games about coronavirus and I've not found any. Remember back when we were storming Area 51? There were so many games about that. There's nothing about coronavirus right now. But I did find an article. Here's a list of games you should play while you're stuck inside avoiding the coronavirus. Pokemon Sword and Shield. Speaking of Pokemon Sword and Shield, subscribe to Draconic. He does awesome live streams on, on Pokemon Sword and Shield. Stardew Valley. PUBG. Don't know what half of these are. Bizarre. I just thought it was a Silent Hill type game. Okay, I might try that out, you know. You know, let me know if you want me to see play Visage in the in the comments. Please comment. I get like no comments. I'd really appreciate a comment. Thank you. Even if it's just saying hi or that I'm ugly. A anything, you know? I, 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 comments are good. Please don't call me ugly. I have a fragile ego. So what I did is that I thought 
there's lots of meme videos, songs going around, so I searched on YouTube, coronavirus funny. And I don't like to get political, but I think YouTube definitely has an agenda. You search coronavirus funny, and it comes up with Trump, 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 Trump. Two funny videos, Trump. Hitler has coronavirus and he is mad. We've tested everyone in the Nazi party, including you, my father. <laughs> Hitler has the coronavirus. You stand, that's not a two meter rule if you're standing that close together. Oh, he's not looking happy. He does not look happy. Yeah, take them glasses off. There you go. Okay. Even Hitler is kind of following the two meter rule. So why aren't you? They eat bats and turtles and cause a global pandemic. Oh, they never heard of a schnitzel. <laughs> what is that? Trump said it's a hoax. Oh, well, that's what you get for believing, you know, I'm not getting political. Maybe we don't uh, get that quite, quite that controversial. We showed you pictures last week of empty shelves in several stores. There's so many empty shelves. Like, I watched a video of Syndicate, who is still around. I've started watching quite a bit of him. But he went to three different supermarkets, and so much was gone up the toilet roll, the nappies, the pasta. And just a week later, the entire supermarkets are shut. Someone I work with, his girlfriend, works at Tesco, and there was 26 cans of beans on the shelf. That was it, in the whole store. 26 cans of beans. Why are you not eating beans? People are like, oh, we can only fit two pizzas in our freezer at a time. Then why are you getting pizza? Why are you getting beans and tuna and tinned food? Why are you getting big cardboard boxes of the pizza which serve as one meal for one person? It's just boomers, isn't it? Literally piling up on her oh, I'm mean, sorry? Cards are extra large for a reason, right? But really? How much is that? One, two, three, four, five. That's like 30 packs of toilet roll. And it looks like there's 20 in a pack. That's 600 rolls of toilet roll. That's two a day. If you're staying isolated for a year. Dude. It's not if it's stacked safely. That could fall on someone and crush him. From what I've seen, the coronavirus infects one in 20. The chance of that falling off is probably around one in 20. You're doubling the risk of someone getting hurt. <laughs> oh, I hope your toilet gets blocked. Yeah, that is a thing. Why are people getting toilet paper? <laughs> you get nappies. Makes sense. Kids. self isolate. You need to keep your kids hygienic. Pasta. That's smart. Dry food doesn't go off. Cook it. Nutritional. Pasta's good. Soap. Hand sanitizer. Keeping clean. That's really, really good. Toilet paper. Just go in the shower. Worst case scenario. Use your bidet. What? Not everyone has a bidet. If you can afford 30 packs of toilet paper, you can probably afford a bidet. I don't even have a bidet. I don't know why I'm saying this. I'm making myself so <laughs> upper class when I'm really not. <laughs> but you know, that's one of my life goals, to have a bidet. Asda given me an idea. Let's have a look at some stuff. Let's have a look at Asda. Asda, if you're from America, Asda is Walmart. But for, for British people, for Londoners, for those of us who just want a cup of tea and a crumpet, does one have much toilet paper? I need to sign it. Nah, that's too much effort. Currently unavailable. Currently unavailable. Currently unavailable. They have some of And Andrex. Look at that little puppy. Unavailable. Andrex. Just buy an Andrex. Unavailable. 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 You can get Andrex and <laughs> and that's it. I was at Tesco earlier today, and there was a queue of about fifty people going down the road. It was open. It wasn't shut. There was still a queue of fifty people going down. Like if it was me, just do a poo there and walk away. That way you get rid of the queue. And you don't need the toilet paper. I mean, you still need the toilet paper. But... Oh, right, so... Sainsbury's website isn't even up and running. We're very busy at the moment because so many people are using the online grocery sites. <laughs> so many people are <laughs> trying to order toilet paper online that they can't even contain it on the website. But it looks like if you're after toilet paper, maybe ask us a place. Last one we had in stock decided to have some fun. <laughs> oh, oh, that's brilliant. Oh, I love that so much. I would pick up the box, place it on my head, and go to purchase my prize. If I passed any snickering stockists, I would crack a joke about how you needed a bigger box. I, I, I don't get it. Social distancing, here we go. We all need to socially distance, so let's have a look at this awesome video. Yes!
That's so I awesome. It's been a while. Oh, okay. Let's take another turn. I've missed you. Right? You it's miss okay. me? You can look at my butt. It's a very nice <laughs> butt. I feel like I can really be vulnerable around you. Right. right. When it comes to the virus, we can protect the vulnerable. But I'm glad I got to see you for a minute. Okay. Bye. Like right. One. That was really awesome. Two. That was really creepy. And three. If I had an eye tracker right now, you would all be judging me really, really harshly. That. That just says a thousand things. You know. Stopping it. You know. You just gotta keep two meters away. Keep two meters back. You know. Right. For the rest of the video, I am just going to go back here. It's not quite two meters. It's about one, but it's better than nothing. Okay. For the rest of the video. I don't have anything else to do in this video. Stay safe. See you in a bit.